Mackay is a beautiful city located on the east side of Australia. Um, it has been built right next to the river called Pioneer and it's a beautiful location. Mackay has a humid tropical climate. On the summertime, on December and January, it's really hot in Mackay. Uh, the temperature can be even 40 degrees. And on winter time, which is on June, July, temperatures can be around 20. So to me, as a Finn, it's ridiculous that your winter is actually the same as our summer. Because you have so hot weather around here, you also have cyclones and really heavy winds and thunderstorms. As in Finland, the temperature is quite low and we don't really have any kind of hurricanes or cyclones or not even earthquakes. So at the moment it's quite high Thai, as you can see. In Finland we don't have Thai, which is interesting. Because first time when I came to Mackay, I wanted to go and swim on a beach. I took my swimming gear, went to the beach, but there was no sea. Where was the sea? Hundreds of meters that way. And that was really odd to me. I have never seen anything quite like it. Uh, also, we don't have crocodiles, sharks, snakes or huge spiders. So Australia, you have them all and you're happy to have them. We don't need them in Finland. <laughs> Australia is a huge country. Finland could actually almost fit between Brisbane and Mackay. The city of Mackay has got his name from a person called John Mackay. In 1860 he was the leader of expedition to the Pioneer Valley. Before John Mackay came here, this area belonged to the Yuwibara people. Hopefully I pronounce it right. Yuwibara, Yuwibara. And uh, the language that they speak is called Yuwi. So they were the original people of Mackay. Tuolla näkyy meidän kotivuori. Me asutaan ton nyppylän päällä. Tossa on semmonen näköala paikka tuolla noin. Sieltä näkyy tänne kaupunkiin ja koko kaupungin yli. I could imagine that all of these little sites had shops, but then eventually they all moved to Cayman Center, Mount Pleasant Center. So they are in the shopping centers nowadays, and there's a lot of office space available in the city center, which is quite, quite sad because the, it would be nice that the city center would be really alive and it would have a lot of bars and little cafeterias and interior shops and that thing. But there is few shops that have remained. Deja Vu is locally owned amazing little interior shop in Sydney Street. Actually, you can have a cup of coffee here as well. The main library is called Danny Doodlis, which I think is a really cute name. It's in the city center and here is something from Finland as well. It's called Kone. Kone is a company that does elevators and these stairs and it's really, really famous for them. Other brand that I constantly see in Mackay is called Huhtamäki. 
huhtamaki. <laughs> I think they pronounce it that way. Huhtamaki makes all of the little cups that you zip coffee, takeaway cups. So next time you're drinking a takeaway uh, coffee, check out the lid of that coffee. If it says huhtamaki, it's from Finland. You can't escape from Harry Potter. Actually, I have read all Harry Potters and they were pretty good. So I'm in the Denny Doodlist library and I will show you the old pictures from Mackay area. Look what I found from here. It's an old book of Mackay. And as you can see, um, the buildings are quite flat. This is an old book, so there is more like tall buildings. It it's look a bit similar still. <laughs> Here are photos of um, cane harvesting. And as you can see, there is several of these buildings actually are still located in the city center. I have seen all of these. In, nine, in 1918, there was a huge cyclone that destroyed a lot of these beautiful buildings and, and there was a lot of casualties because of the cyclone. And the next thing I'm going to show you is the gypsy and the power bird. Actually, get coffee here as well. Oh, look at these beautiful shoes. I like they're somehow really Scandinavian, and I actually know that my friend Jonna would love these. So tell me, baby, where would you like to go? Maybe we'll drive from coast to coast, only to where we love the most. I'm harmony of these colors. Perfectly mixed. Could I please buy all of these, one for each color, and then we could put some cactus in it. These are actually Australian artists called the Chai Basisek, and I actually bought one of these for my uh, daughter as a Christmas present. I really like his style. I think I might get a few prints before I get back to Finland. All of my kids start to be too big for these kind of things. Should I make a baby so I can buy all of them? I have a thing for baskets. I think people just can't own enough baskets. So, if I buy one more, would that hurt? No? This lamp actually has a Scandi vibe in it, and then there is also this Bohemian style. So, Scandi meets Boho. One of my favorite places in Mackay. And yeah, now I would like to have some lunch. So I'm gonna go to the Wood Street. Wood Street is the best place to get a nice meal. 